factors that affect the magnitude of the induced current. Whenever there is relative motion between conductor and magnetic field, an electromotive force is induced, hence an induced current is produced. Faraday's law states that the size of the induced electromotive force is directly proportional to the rate at which the conductor cuts through the magnetic field lines. There are three factors that affect the magnitude of the induced current, speed of movement, number of turns in the coil, and the strength of magnetic field. Induced current can be increased by moving the magnet, or the solenoid at a higher speed. When the magnet is moved at a faster speed into the conductor, or solenoid the galvanometer, shows a larger deflection. A larger current is induced in the solenoid. By increasing the number of turns on the solenoid will increase the induced current. For example, the galvanometer shows a larger deflection when the magnet is moved slowly into the solenoid of 20 turns, compared to 10 turns of solenoid. This shows a larger current is induced in the solenoid. The induced current can be increased by increasing the strength of the magnetic field through the use of a stronger magnet. For example, when a stronger magnet made by binding two bar magnets together is moved slowly into the solenoid, the galvanometer shows a larger deflection. This shows a larger current is induced in the solenoid. Thank you for taking time to watch this.